It was a bright sunny morning. Heidi woke up early. She sat up and wondered where she was. When she heard her grandfather's voice, she remembered that she was on the mountain with her grandfather. She got down the ladder from the left where her bed was. Peter the goat herd is here. Would you like to go to the grasslands with him, Heidi? Yes, I would. No. Carry some food for your midday meal. Keep the big slices of bread and cheese in your haversack, Peter. Take this cup too. Use it to give milk from the goat to Heidi. All right. Peter took along his own goats and grandfather's goats, named Little Swan and Little Bear. Peter and Heidi set off to the pasture happily. Heidi was jumping there with joy. I'm so delighted to be on the mountains here. The flowers on the mountain slopes are lovely. The red, purple, and yellow flowers are so beautiful. I want to take some of these for Grandfather. It is fun to run around here. I'm so happy. You have plucked so many flowers. Come on, we have to go a long way. On the highest cliff, there sits an eagle. He shrieks very loudly. Oh, then let's go. But it was such a beautiful place that Peter decided to rest for a while. He kept his haversack in a little hollow of the ground and fell asleep. The bright golden sunshine, the fresh air, the sweet smell of the flowers are all amazing. There is nothing better than to remain here forever. Oh, that's the loud, harsh cry of the bird. Peter, wake up! Wake up! The great bird is there. Oh yes, he's an eagle. Now he's gone. Where has he gone? To his nest. Is his nest up there? It must be so nice to live high up on the mountains. But why does he screech like that? Because it's his nature to do so, and he can't help it. Peter and Heidi sat down to have food. It was time for dinner. Let's sit and eat. The two large pieces of bread and cheese are for you. Here's milk for you from the goat named Little Swan. I'll have milk from my goat Spot. Okay, you can have this piece of bread and some cheese from here too, if you like. I have a lot. Thanks. That's surprising. I never had any food to give away all my life. The big goat with the strong horns is Turk. The thin one is Green Finch, or just Finch. The little white goat is Snowflake. Peter. Can you tell me the names of the other goats? Why is Snowflake crying? She's crying because she has been separated from her mother. She was taken and sold to someone in Mainfield yesterday. Oh, poor little Snowflake! Do not cry any more. Come here. I come here with you every day. Heidi hugged Snowflake and she felt better. She stopped bleating. Let me tell you, the prettiest of all goats are Little Swan and Little Bear. Hmm. I know. Uncle Elp keeps them clean and gives them salt every day. He has a very nice stall for them. Peter asked Heidi to give him some cheese the next day too. She said that she would give bread too, and every day. Peter and Heidi became best friends later. She was happy to live there and roam freely with her best friend and the goats.